Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. In this video, I will show you how I achieved this Conan look. As you can see, I'm already wearing my colored contact lenses. These are Fresh Go in the color Fiesta Peru. And I got them online at coleyes.com. And I will put the link below just in case you want to get the same pair. You're gonna see me a lot doing this in this video. I'm trying to focus my camera so you can see the product that I'm using but my camera is just not having it Anyhow, this eyeliner that I'm using here is the L'Oreal Infallible and um, it is in the color black brown and I'm only using this to water um, I don't know exactly what it's called um, specifically it's it's underneath your eyelashes. It's like the waterline but on top. For false lashes, I got this wing metamorphosis eyes by Salon Perfect and I got this from Walmart. To attach the false lashes, I'm gonna be using this KISS Strip Lash Adhesive. Now using my Revlon eyelash curler, I will be curling my falsies and my real eyelashes together. Using my BH Cosmetics Eyes on the 60s palette, I will use that purple matte eyeshadow and apply it all over my eyelids. I do have eye makeup brush but I'm losing my fingers for this because I want to be able to pack on more makeup. We want to go heavy on this because if you look at Conan, she's always flaunting those nice purple eyeshadows. Now using the same eyeshadow palette, I will be taking some of the white and I will be packing that on the inner corner of my eyes. Using my EM Cosmetics liquid eyeliner, I will start to line the base of my falsies. And I will also create a little wing on the outer corner of my eyes. Going back to my L'Oreal Infallible Eyeliner in Black Brown, I will go ahead and line the outer half corners of my eyes. Again, using my EM Cosmetics Liquid Eyeliner, I'm gonna be drawing false 
lower eyelashes on the outer corner of my eyes and I'm only doing two or three of these We're done with the eyes and now time for foundation and for this look i am using l'oreal's infallible pro matte foundation in the shade 104.5 you're gonna see that this foundation looks a little lighter on my face but that's because i have red face <laughs> that's how i call it um it seems like my face is a little darker than the rest of my body but you'll see soon that this color actually match pretty good um, on my neck and my hands Now I'm gonna be using Almay's loose finishing powder to set my foundation Now using the darkest brown in my e.l.f. contour palette, I will go ahead and contour the sides of my nose. Using my BH Cosmetics Take Me to Brazil eyeshadow palette, I will take the violet matte eyeshadow color and use that to fill in my eyebrows. I'm also using the same color to line my lower lash line. Now taking my BH Cosmetics 10 color blush palette, I will be using that coral color to blush my cheeks. Now for lips, I will be using this Urban Decay lip color in the shade Wrong Number. For Conan's piercing, I bought a small bag of beads at the dollar store 
and I use a sharpie to color it black. Now using the same adhesive that I use for my false lashes, I'm going to glue this bead right below my lower lid. Time to put on the rest of the costume. I couldn't find any pre-made Conan wig that I like, so I went ahead and bought a different wig. This was actually a waist-long wig and it's also very curly. So I went ahead and cut it. I cut it short and then I used my hair straightener to straighten it. I made this bun using some of the hairs that I got off from the wig and I glued it on a roll of paper. Because Conan was an origami master, I spent two days practicing creating this origami rose. And I used a table napkin to create this. And here is my completed gone and look. If you guys like this video, please go ahead and hit the like button. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please hit the subscribe button and the notification bell. Thank you all so much for watching and I will see you on my next video. Bye!